Have you ever wanted to go somewhere but were too lazy to drive? Oh yeah, of course I would. Have you ever wanted your car to drive you around? Yeah, who, who, who wouldn't want that? Well, I'm sad to announce that this technology is far into the future. Oh man, that really sucks. Researchers are discovering new technologies each and every year. Some examples of technology are ABS, parallel parking, and rear view cameras. Can you believe that all these technologies are in newer vehicles? Are you for serious? Are you for serious? Are you for serious? Some new technologies that are being developed right now are steering and throttle control. Can you believe that? Oh, heck no. No, I can't believe that. These new technologies will reduce the need of actual drivers driving vehicles. These newer vehicles will use optical cameras and sensors to keep them in their own lane and driving on course. Using these cameras and sensors in new cars will reduce traffic jams and will make traffic flow much more smoothly. Can you believe the National Traffic Highway Association allowed this? Oh, that's crazy. No way. <laughs> Yes, it is very crazy. Many highway officials have come to the conclusion that there is much more need for testing to make sure that this can run flawlessly. Michigan is actually one of the only states that allows them to be tested on public roads. Wow, that's scary. Yeah, it's pretty scary, but it has to be done. Many people say that the government should protect automakers from lawsuits during the development of this technology. One question commonly asked is, will customers willing, be willing to buy expensive vehicles that don't require much interaction with the driver? Several officials believe that getting the self-driving vehicle on the road will be a social acceptance. Would you be interested in driving a vehicle of such kind? I think it would be awesome to own a car like that. Yeah!